What is up my friends, and welcome to a brand new season of my TPL Response series, called TPL Response Season 6. Today is June 2, 2024. Back in May 31, 2024, me and my parents have all went out for a while and came back from another funfair called Carnival Thrill, which was located at another GAA football club, not the old one I went to back in October 31, 2023, or should I say, Halloween 2023 to watch the firework event from 8.45 to 9 p.m. at the pitch black and dark night, but it was actually the new GAA football club. And speaking of the old GAA football club that I went to back in October 31st, this is also another reason on why Halloween is one of my favorite holiday of all time, because of the firework event at nighttime to celebrate the best holiday. Well anyways, I wanna talk about that fun fair I went to from two days ago. Well, the fun fair I went to two days ago was really good, but it seems to be a wee bit small, because of the fact that there weren't that many rides in there. They only had five rides, called the Waltzer, the Classic and Nostalgic Octopus, the Kitty Rides, the Swinging Chair Ride, and the Zigzag, the Sizzler to Point Zero, and there were also the Game Things, and the Food Stall. And there was this attraction that I found and was my favorite one about that fun fair I went to. I have saw the Haunted Mansion in the fun fair, and it is one of my favorite walking through attraction in that fun fair I went to. And I have also seen some boys and girls go inside the haunted mansion, and I bet that some of them were scared of the animatronics in there. And also there were some creepy and eerie ghostly sound effects in that haunted house. Ooh, spooky right? And this is yet again another reason on why Halloween is my favorite holiday of all time, because of the haunted mansion at the fun fair, and the creepy and eerie sound effects in the haunted mansion. And then, on our way home, we went over to get me some food. And in there, I got a white candy floss in a bag, and it tasted so sugary and sweet. And yeah, that was pretty much the story about my time at Carnival Thrill at the GAA car park. So anyways, for today's response episode, and also for the first response for TPL Response Season 6, this is going to be on Amazing JG's 5-hour commentary on my 4-hour and 52-minute response video on him. And in this first response episode of Season 6, I am portraying as Sky Holland. Because I think she is a beautiful singer, and she has such a great singing voice for whenever it comes to her singing. And since this video of his is 5 hours and 30 to minutes long, I am going TP have to split this video into 5 parts. So basically, every 5 parts will all be 1 hour long each. So this means, part 1 of today will be the first 1 hour long. And I will be explaining the next parts after this first part. So without further ado, let us now kick off with this new season. Off we go. As soon I get to December more, second RETOT2K24, and a still day, I am doing this commentary. Hi there people watching. And welcome to the 27th episode of TPL Responds Season 2. Today is February 10th, 2024. Three more days to go until my brother's birthday. whoop de doo we are getting even more close. Just like how we were getting even more close to my birthday when it was September 29th, 2023. I hope you all are excited for my brother's birthday coming up soon. So, anyways for today's response episode. This is going to be on Media JG's quadruple commentary on me and Foxy the Fox 110. And in this video, I am portraying as my favorite dance member of diversity, Puri Keeley, in purple and black fading gradient variant. And since this quadruple commentary of his is going to be extremely long, because the video's duration is for hours and 42 minutes long, so this means, I will have to split this video into six parts. So, basically, I am going to be doing the first 55 minutes of this response video, and for parts 2 and 5. It will also be the next 55 minutes of the response video. And then for part 6 will be the last whatever minutes of this response video. And I had to download this quadruple commentary video of his. In 144, P quality because I do not want my iPad to run out of storage. 
So, without further ado, let us now begin this very, very long response video. Off we go. No time. What are the things that the pimp lover and Foxy the Fox 110 slash Foxy Gaming really make up lies and crap about me? Well, they say that I cannot handle sh when I can. That's a lie, dude. So stop the cap. You can't handle shit, dude. What's that supposed to mean? That means that Foxy cannot handle crap. Actually, Gigi, you're the actual one who can't handle crap, not Foxy, or me either, because we can handle some stuff, unlike you. For example, you can't handle me and Foxy telling the truth about you. And you also can't handle the fact that you disrespected my opinion on Foxy back in October 2023, which was the month of me and my mum's birth month, which was, for me, on October 1st, and for my mum, on October 5th, which her birthday is for days after my birthday, and it also had my favorite holiday, Halloween in that month. And the fact that you disrespected Foxy's opinion on me back in November 2023, which was the month of my dad's birth month, which was on November 21st. And me and the pimple lover are right about you. You guys are not right about me. You are lying to me. Speeding this up since TPL repeats the same annoying crap over and over again. So suck it up and deal with it. When I can say they mess with me, mess, they mess with me 24-7. That's a lie, dude. We don't mess with you 24-7. In fact, we don't even mess with you. No. They, they claim that I bash opinions on themselves when yet they use advice term. They claim that I make up lies about them when really I'm speaking truth about them. Dude, first of all, you do bash opinions. Dude, repeat. I didn't ask you for permission to talk in this part. Now shut your mouth up. More. Now, so will you. Using advice term in the right context, dude. Advice does a, is a, it's not always an excuse for opinion bashing, you know. <laughs> We're using advice the right me and the pimp love are using advice the right way. And you actually do bash opinions, so don't deny it. And you actually do make lies about us, dude. Again, repeat. I didn't ask you for permission to talk in this part. Now shut your mouth up. When little and really, I mean, speaking the truth about them. No, you're not speaking the truth about us, dude. You may get lies about us. Yes, I can, you child. No, you don't speak the truth about us, dude. And you beat up my past as well. They kind of what the fuck? Lies about them when really speaking. The truth. You do make lies about us, dude, and you don't speak the truth about us, dude. You're speaking the lies about us, and you beat up my past as well. He claims I made the one that was factual, and I made it some difficult to take. Imagine you would mistake it as excuse, dude. <laughs> you literally admitted to it, dude. You really made to one of them, dude. They claim that they are right about me when they're wrong about me. Dude, we're actually right about you. Don't deny it. <laughs> they claim they brought a past when I don't care if it's from the past week. I didn't have to make this community tab post. Yes. What the fuck? Dude, you literally just stole my mom's joke. You know that my mum is the one that owns that joke. And you cannot steal my mum's joke. Man, my mum sure is not very happy because of what you did earlier on. No it doesn't dude. They claim that they're not making up lies about me when they, they really are. No we're not dude. Yes the hell you guys are. No the hell we are not making up lies about you you big dumbass. Blah blah blah. You know you're really rude. You're we're speaking the truth about you. They prove they deny the fact that they make up and that and that proves that they do not deny the fact that they make up lies about me. Dude, we never made lies about you, dude. You're, you're denying the fact that you make lies about us. Make up lies about us, dude. And you're also denying the fact that and you also deny the fact that you just back your opinions. No, you can't handle that, dude. You can't handle the people who defend me. Yes, I can. You're a liar and a coward! They claim that I can't handle her. Depending on when I actually can. No, you can't, dude. Yes, I can. You're a liar. And finally, they claim that I- Oh, wow. 
I am so glad that JG did not respond to the part of where I called him a liar. This means that he has finally admitted that he is a liar to me and Foxy. Wow, well done, JG, well done, although I still hate you. Every single fact they gave me, they gave me when I, I ain't dying them, I'm saying the, I was just saying the truth. Dude, you're not saying the truth, and you are denying the facts that we gave you, dude. I told you, leave me alone. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, you nasty <laughs> so, dude, so don't deny it. Okay, so Foxy the Fox 
podcasts and other types of videos that you can think of. Five. Keep in mind to like Darman, and I watched him back in 2021 of July. She goes over every user's channel rules by giving full details to change something in every user's channel rules. Well, I used to put channel rules in my third Terminator channel back in 2021, but after I see people's comments on my video, they put in channel rules. I deleted them. And after I will I wonder how you got terminated. Maybe it's because of your behavior. Well, it's because of the freaking interrupting people's videos when I was about to do freaking effects and interrupting rounds. Hold on a second. Another reason is that I changed my account birth date from March 10th, 1984 to July 18th, 2010. God, you're freaking hard. That was in August 22, 2021. Stupid agents, these old brains already. Back in May 3. Way around. Idiot. Well, only reverse card right back at you. Even I'm more. Basically, disrespecting. Frickin', I'm ending the video right here. Bye. Well, this time we hate a percept. Other way around three. You know, reverse card. Plus. Actually, yes. Quit. 
calling me a furry. Hell no. Just because I have a fox in my October 2023 profile picture, doesn't mean it makes me a furry. So this proves that you are judging a book by its cover. Because he was basically denying the fact that he was disrespecting the Wolf Brothers' opinion. Now anyways, that's the end of the Fox Reacts. And hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Foxy the Fox, one in ten. Uh that commentary was ridiculous and disastrous. It's actually the other way around, you stupid ass clown. Don't know. Actually, yeah. Anyway. What the fuck? Anyways, see you later. Okay, guys, I am going to be going now. And I am going to let my bestie continue on with the next two commentaries on his own. So, goodbye bestie. Thank you for featuring me in this first part of the triple commentary. You are not welcome degenerate. I wasn't talking to you. I am not talking about that. I was saying you are not welcome when you are saying thanks. Well, she was still not talking to you when she said that. Plus rude much? Okay. Goodbye, Foxy the Fox 110. Before I get started, I just want to say don't attack this user or I witch hunt him anything. Anyways, let's get started. Uh, this user is making me so angry to the point where I want to play Minecraft and explode him with a TNT because he the fuck, likes to make up lies about me. Dude, he doesn't even make up lies about you, dude. He's speaking the truth about you. Oh, fuck. Was well, literally the truth, dude. He is speaking the truth about you. Well, thank you for handling the pins on him. That's a rare debut for you. That's a rare debut for you, but it's just that. Just begin the rant. The Panther Lover, Miles Morales, C. Diego, and Fortnite Champion Series fan has got to be the one of the worst users I have ever seen in my life. I am going to give you all the reasons on why this user sucks. One, his commentaries are terrible. That's an opinion, not a reason. I'm saying... That's, I'm saying that's an opinion, and not a reason. Two, you can't handle any crap like hate, crit- Cause he can handle hate criticism. And the truth about Foxy the- Actually you can, so deal with it. Cause you say it's the truth about me, doesn't mean it's actually the truth about me. Plus you guys aren't even speaking the truth about me. Well, all I went through was doing this in, in this video on me was bringing up my past and complaining about my content. It's 110. Three. His content is freaking horrible. Again, that's an opinion, not a reason. Dude, I don't even know what to say here. Four. He is the biggest hypocrite and a liar in the planet. He's not a hypocrite and a liar. He's not a hypocrite and a liar, dude, but you are. Don't know. Actually, you are. Example, he claims that I bash opinions, yet he criticizes my opinion. I bet you only skipped that part because you know I'm right. No, because I disagree with you. No. Okay, enough. That's enough. Right now. It's me, Edward the Friday Night Funkin' and Memes Guy 5K9. Panther lover hater, Frankie Cunt at Disney hater 2001, and other users like they are worse than Hitler. Where's your proof? The proof is that me makes too many commentaries out of us. That's not poop at all, dude. Seven. Back from months ago. Let's know he makes response videos nowadays. He brings up Jason the YouTube guy 2K5's past by past being up a month. Just doing commentary. Well, I'm calling you out for being up his past, dude. ...videos from two years ago, and that's all the reasons on why he sucks. Who likes this user? Foxy the Fox 110. Who hates this user? AK2 the the Panther lover hater. Frankie Cunn the Disney hater 2001. Edward the Friday Night Funkin' and Memes Guy 5K9. Brady the BFDI fan. Jared the Film Guy, Thomas the Foxy the Fox 110 Hater, Leah the Amazing Teen Woman 2K6 slash Leah the Bandori Fan 1997, and others. End of- Anyways, that meant sucked.
And anyways, on to next one. Final video, I'm gonna box respawn, so I'm gonna put a triple fox respawn. Okay, let us move on to the next video. Intro, please get away from my face already. Because I am so angry right now. First, it was Leah the amazing teen woman to K6 who ranted on me. And now, it is JG that ranted on me with invalid reasons. Let's just begin this response video already. The hell with it. Ugh, this user is making me so angry to the point where I want to play Minecraft and explode him with AGNT because he likes to make up lies about me. If you like this user, that's okay. Hypocrite much. Because you claim that you are okay with people's opinions on me, but yet you disrespect opinions. How? Because you bashed Foxy the Fox 110's opinion on me back on her. Salute on me back in July 23rd, 2023. And you also bashed my opinion on Foxy the Fox 110 back on my salute on her back in April 15th, 2023. Well, what a hypocrite. He's not making up lies about you, dude. Yes, he is. <laughs> He's speaking the truth. And imagine raging over the people who are speaking the truth about you. <laughs> Honestly, dude. How immature can you be? Anyways, let's just begin the rant. The Panther Lover. Miles Morales, CD Ebbett, and Fortnite Champion Series fan has got to be the one of the worst users I have ever seen in my life. I am going to give you all the reasons on why this user sucks. Well, they better be stated with valid reasons. Otherwise, you are going to make up some poor and lame excuses. 1. His commentary is terrible. The pimp lover doesn't even make up excuses, dude. Yes, yes. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, you nasty. That is not a reason to hate me. That is just an opinion. Come up with a reason instead of an opinion. No, he doesn't. No! Two. He can't handle any crap like hate, criticism, and the truth about Foxy the Fox 110. That is because they are not speaking the truth about her. I was speaking the truth about her in my rant. No, you weren't. Video on her. Three. His content is freaking horrible. Again, that is not a reason to hate me. That is just an opinion. Stop using opinions in your rants instead of reasons. No, he doesn't. Four. He is the biggest hypocrite and a liar in the planet. No, you're the actual one who is a hypocrite and a liar. Hell no, I am not. Actually, you are it is the it. other way around. Nah. No! Oh. Five. Speaking of the previous reason, he makes up lies about me. Dude, you are actually the one who makes up lies about me and Foxy. So no, I do not make up lies about you. Well, he never makes up lies about you, dude. Did Foxy admit he makes up lies about me? He speaks the truth about you. Six. He treats me, Edward the Friday Night Funkin' and memes guy 5k9, ak2 the the panther lover hater, Frankie Con the Disney hater 2001, and other users like they are worse than Hitler. Dude, I do not treat you all like you are all worse than Hitler. All I do is to teach you all a strict lesson to never mess with me. Well, the example is that you make too much commentaries on us. Well, he makes response videos nowadays. Okay, I knew it. And also, he... That is not proof... 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 I mean, that's not proof, dude. What the fuck? Dude. Stop stealing my mum's joke already, for crying out loud. 7. Back from months ago, he brings up Jason the YouTube guy 2K5's past by just doing commentaries on his videos from two years ago. Dude, 
I just didn't realize that those videos that Jason made was from the past. Plus, my autistic remembrances is not that good sometimes. Sometimes I forget about something. But at least I now know that those videos that Jason made was from the past. And that's all the reasons on why he sucks. Who likes this user? Foxy the Fox 110. Who hates this user? AK Tooth of the Panther Lover Hater. Oh, I know him. He's that stupid cold-hearted jerk that sent me a very violent threat back in December 30th, 2023. Frankie Kunda Disney Hater 2001. A K.A., a a user who loves to complain about people's intros 20 for 7. Just like the Federal Express fan 2024 does to my intros. Edward the Friday Night Funkin' and Memes Guy 5K9. Brady the BFDI fan. Jared the Film Guy. Oh yes. That stupid person who kept claiming that me and Foxy abused our pets. When we didn't abuse our cats and dogs. Even though I don't have a dog, and even though Foxy doesn't have a cat. Which I have a cat called Patch. And she will be turning 14 in August of 2024. Thomas the Foxy the Fox 110 hater. Leah the Amazing Teen Woman 2K6 slash Leah the Bandori fan 1997. And others. End of... Well, this rant video sucked. Because he used two opinions instead of two reasons in this rant video. And he was also being a hypocrite. But anyways, I don't have time for the out row for today. Because I have to get working on my 14th response episode for tomorrow tonight. What's up? It's me, Foxy the Fox 110. And welcome to Foxy's Approvals Season 3, Episode 67. And this is another approval in the pen forever. Now anyways, before we get started, I just want to say that I, that I know this commentary of the pen forever is going to rock. Anyways, let's get started. Hello everybody watching, and welcome back to a brand new commentary video on this channel. Today is December 3rd, 2023. A brand new chapter of Fortnite just started today, and the game is already ready to be Sorry about that. That was my stomach. played. This is all about Chapter 5, Season 1, and the name of the current chapter and season is called Underground. I have seen the launch trailer of Chapter 5, Season 1, and to me, it was really good. The map cool. looks really incredible, possibly one of the best map I have ever seen. And yesterday, I watched the Big Bang Live event on Oli's live stream on YouTube, and to me, I thought that that event was totally the best Black Hole Remix event I have ever seen. The reason why I had to watch it on YouTube is because I unexpectedly got logged out of Fortnite. I tried to log back in, but I had to wait in the queue for one hour and five minutes, which wasn't really fair. So I had to watch it on YouTube instead. But other than that, I still really enjoyed the event. So anyways, for today's commentary, this is going to be on JG the December guy to K10's commentary on Foxy the Fox 110's run on him. And in this video, I am portraying as Alexia Putellas. So, without the delay, let's roll up the video. Lights. Camera. Action. Hey, 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 what's up everyone? It's me, JJ the December guy, 2K10. Imagine copying Foxy the Fox 110's old introduction. I know, right? We care enough to make this commentary video. Well, I said we do not care. Well, she already said that you cared enough to make that commentary video you did. Actually, JG, the correct answer is that you cared enough to make this commentary video. And welcome to my first commentary of December 2023. This is also my second commentary on someone's rant on me. The first one was on this show's rant on me in Season 3 Episode 1, the Season 3 premiere on Jill, uh, June 1st. 
could tell that from this show was a dead topic, but still, this commentary is on Foxy the Furious rant on me. Man, will you ever stop calling Foxy a furry for once? You know that she hates being called that, yeah. and plus, she is not a furry. Yeah. Just because she used to have a fox in her previous picture didn't mean it made her a furry. And this proves that you are judging a book by its cover, so stop it. To be honest, my pop, my pop, the profile picture they have for December is that is it is it is an animatronic fox. And let's get started. What's up? It's me, Foxy the Fox One Eight Ten, and welcome to Foxy's Vance Season One, Episode Six. And this rant is going to be on JG, the November person, 2K10. Now, anyways, before we get started, I just, I just want to say, if you like this user, I can handle your opinion. Now, anyways, let's get started. JG, the November person, 2K10. Oh my god, this user sucks. No, you. Dude, she was absolutely saying the truth. You are the only one who sucks. Because you keep calling Foxy the Fox 110 a furry. Yeah. Good much? You're a liar and a coward! I mean disrespectful much? I'm talking about the part where you said ugly. And how about you shut up your mouth instead? Which you should know that she hates being called that. And how about you shut your mouth instead? And you claim that you handle the minions, but yet you disrespect me. Foxy and Peter's opinions on stuff we like or hate. Yeah. I'm not even lying about you. You're a liar. Shut the fuck up, you nasty bitch. Yes, you do bash opinions, dude. <laughs> I mean, we don't lie about you, dude. I mean, me and the pimp lover don't lie about you, dude. You do, but you do bash opinions. Also, stop. Don't say a word. Shut the fuck up, you nasty bitch. <laughs> and imagine raging over the truth about you. How even immature. Though even though I hate Peter, I can handle your opinion. And that's the reasons why. Yeah, I will. He's number one. You lied about my opinion on Wes and Perez because he claims that I support Wes and Perez when I don't anymore. Because I stopped supporting Wes and Perez sometime last year. He's number two. He's a past bringer up because, he's, because he brings up my past. When I have already apologized and learned my lesson, Wow, let's give it because I don't know what she's saying. Reason number three. Back when the Panther Lover had the Wolf Lover in his username, he called the Panther Lover the stupid Wolf Lover. Like, seriously, dude, that's just disrespectful. Freak. We call him the stupid Panther Lover. Because we, it's just an idea from someone else, I don't know. I don't freaking know it. Well, that doesn't mean you have to call me that name. Exactly. Because that name is very disrespectful. And oh, quit calling me a stupid panther lover. Yeah. Just because what I love said. panthers doesn't mean you have to call me that disrespectful mock name. Yeah. And you know he's being called that. He's number four. He's a hypocrite because he claims he can have no opinions, yet he disrespected the panther lover's opinion when he did a commentary on the panther. When we did a commentary on the panther lover's approval video on me, 
Wow, dude, what a hypocrite. Not your much. She's not lying. Yeah. Stop lying. She was literally saying the word hypocrite in the right context. Yeah. Because you claim you handle opinions, but yet you disrespected my opinion on Foxy the Fox 110 or my salute on her. Back in April 15, yeah. 2023. And I even have six proofs of that to show off this claim. Here it is. Shall we? Okay, so Foxy the Fox 110 the Emoji Marbles fan is one of the greatest user I have ever seen on YouTube. No, she mm -hmm. is the most stupid fury player I've ever seen. I mean, user, not player. God freaking darn it! Now what the freaking heck? Her Foxy reacts videos on any users is very full detailed and an absolute masterpiece they're absolute freaking invalid because she cannot handle being called a freaking fury her intro is very good no her intro is stupid six she makes good posts on her community post I would love to see him try denying this. For constantly bashing my opinion on her. Shame on you, dude. Shame on you. And shame on you for making up lies about the... And shame on you for denying your wrongdoings. Shame on you for trying to make the Panda lover say that I can't be trusted and forgiven, or I'm unforgivable. No, shame on you for being a falsifier of facts. And bruh. I would never say that you can't be trusted or forgiven, because you are not even a criminal. This is more proof that you're denying wrongdoings. What the fuck? I do not disrespect people's opinions, you liar. What's up? It's me, Foxy the Fox 110. And welcome to Foxy's Approvals Season 3. Episode 46, and this is another approval on the Panther Lover. Anyways, I know that this commentary of the Panther Lovers is going to rock. Anyways, let's get started. Hello there, my great viewers on YouTube, and welcome back to a brand new commentary video on this channel. Today is November 6, 2023, and for today's commentary for today, this is going to be on... GG the November person to the attendees truth video about Foxy the Fox 110. And in this video, I am portraying as Jackie Smith. Why you may ask is because I think she is a good former secretary of state for the home department. Oh man, this video is gonna get blown up with no support since this video has some lame and poor excuses in this truth video. But without the delay, let's roll up the video. Foxy the Fox 110. Okay, so 
start the truth with you. Foxy the Fox 110 is one of the worst furries I have ever seen. Dude, she is not a fur. Exactly. Just because she used to have a fox in her previous profile picture didn't mean it made her a furry. Exactly. So, this proves that you are judging a book by its cover. Yeah. Now, I would highly appreciate it if you would stop calling her a furry. Exactly. Family. I agree. Because she hates it when people call her that. Yeah. I stand corrected. Let me tell you the reasons why I hate this you, are. One, she can't handle every single thing like people calling her furry, criticism, and other crap. You're so dumb. You are really Agreed. dumb. For real. Like really. Handle the whole thing. Actually, it's you. Two, she said that CP can be forgiven when in reality it cannot because it's a serious crime and you can go to jail. Wow, that. dude, just freaking wow. You have now brought up her past. Exactly. You know that she totally regrets from saying that CP can be forgiven. Yeah, exactly. You should know that CP shall never be forgiven at any cost. That's what this scumbag gets for freaking with all of us. I'm not a scumbag, dude. You're the only one who's a scumbag. And also, I don't even think, think with you guys, dude, or what you said, just said. Back when so I can see what he said. She can't handle every single thing like people calling her furry, criticism, and other crap. You're so dumb. You are really Agreed. dumb. For real. Like really. Handle thing already. Two. She said that CP can be forgiven when in reality it cannot because it's a serious crime and you can go to jail. Wow, dude, just freaking wow. You have now brought up her past. Exactly. You know that she totally regrets from saying that CP can be forgiven. Yeah, exactly. You know that CP shall never be forgiven at any cost. That's what this scumbag gets for freaking with all of us. I never even think what you guys dude. And I don't care if forgiving CP is from the past because you can. We care enough to make this commentary video. Actually, no. Yes. Fans and infinity percent haters and have base. Well, I well now I have more fans. I mean, I mean, right now I have more fans than haters because a lot of users lost hatred on me. Three. Even she even even though I mean, even though that some users. Are now neutral to me, but still. Back in 2022. Dude, this is it still means that it still means that. But I mean, but still, this. I mean, but still, because they still lost hatred on me, even though some of them are neutral to me. Like the time yeah. I also don't care if supporting Wilson Paris is from the past because. Well, you can't have to make this commentary video. Yeah. Good point. But you still suck as hell. Which is last year. Four. She laughed at the disgust even saw Joe Coachella, which is not good at all. Seriously, dude, that was a total mistake. Yeah. Because she didn't even read the community post title correctly. If she did read it correctly. How about you shut the hell up instead? A no reverse card right back at you, you dumb brat. And you're the only one needs to touch grass. Then she wouldn't have laughed at it. Exactly. Did you even think about saying that she did it on purpose? Because she didn't do it on purpose. Yeah. She made a because me and pimp because me and the pimp lover actually do go outside. Stink. Six. She spends commentaries back and forth. That means you're the one who the one who needs to touch grass. Exactly. 
nine. Double reason. She denied her wrongdoings and she deleted posts every time people share it. Eleven. She commented on them video on an offensive joke on COD. Dude, that was seriously an autocorrect. Yeah. Because what she was meant to say was OMFG, not LMO. Exactly. Wow. You seriously can't handle the mistakes. Yeah. Fourteen. Her reaction videos and response videos are commentaries. Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? No, he doesn't, dude. Well, it's actually the other way around, dude. the other way around. This wraps up the truth video, and that's the end. Remember to like, comment, share, subscribe. Don't forget to turn on the bell button so you won't miss a new video. Anyways, this is me, Gigi the November Person 2K10, signing off. Open out. See you tomorrow. Goodbye. Stay awesome. And I'm Just three more videos, please. What's up? It's me. Foxy. Do me a favor. Shut the fuck up. No, you Welcome to my first ever septuple commentary, folks. I don't have any sextuple, nonuple, and decuple commentaries on my channel yet, but for this septuple commentary, I will be doing commentaries on seven videos. And these videos are Foxy the Big 110S commentary on my triple commentary. The stupid Panther Lover's commentary on my commentary on Foxy's salute on him. His commentary on my commentary on. Foxy's rant on me, his commentary on my commentary on Foxy's commentary on my truth video on her, his commentary on my commentary on Foxy's commentary on my rant on her, Foxy's commentary on my truth video on her, and Foxy's rant on Adrian the Interruption Channel the Christmas Man 689. Okay, let's begin with the first video. What's up? It's me, Foxy the Fox 110. And welcome to Foxy Response, Season 2, Episode 41. In this Foxy Response, is going to be on JG's Triple Commentary on me. Anyways, before we get started, I just want to say, don't attack this user or witch or anything. No, anyways, let's get started.
them to most certainly not Foxy. I can't help because them. you spam rants on people you hate. Yeah. Dude, I rant on them for good reasons. I don't spam rant. Well, I do rant on people for good reasons, dude. on them, dude. I upload rant video. I make rant videos and upload them when I feel like it. Even commentaries on them, including me. I don't even spam them. No, I don't. Videos, dude, because if I did, I'd be uploading some with them and I'd try to be a ton. Spams, commentaries, long rants, commentaries. Just, I don't even spam them, dude. No, I don't. Because if I did, I'd be uploading some with them and I'd try to be a ton. Slanders. When you have any host, she does commentaries on them. I'm not dumb. You are dumb. You scoundrel. Dude, the pimple is not dumb. Well, dude. Well, yes, he is. Also, dude, I don't spam rant videos because I only upload rant videos when I feel like it. And when I do upload rant videos when I feel like it, it's only one rant video. Because he called me dumb for speaking the truth about you. No, you're speaking the truth about me, dude. Go back a minute. Because he called me dumb for speaking the truth about you. No, you're speaking the truth about me. Well, what I'm saying is, you were not even speaking the truth about me. Guess what? What's up, you nasty bitch? I don't know. What I'm saying, you. I was basically. Say, saying that you were not speaking a truth about, about me. Guess what? <laughs> so I was basically in, responding to what you were saying. So what I mean by is, by that is. You don't speak about truth about me in general. I mean, you don't even speak the truth about me in general. Yeah, and that goes for your truth video on me. Or should I say your quote unquote truth video on me? Alright everyone, this is the end of the first part of my first response episode of season 6, and part 2 of this episode will be coming tomorrow, and it will be the next one hour long, so, I will see you all tomorrow in the next part, farewell.